Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can create a gig on Upwork. So from the main page of Upwork, you want to scroll down until you see this to this option to post a job. So we want to click on post a job. So from here, we want to we can choose either short term or part time work or longer term work. So for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to do short term work. And then we can click on continue. So the next step is writing a title for our job. So I'm going to do video. Yeah, I'm going to do video creator and it's automatically going to match us with the category. So job category, it puts us in video production. If it doesn't match your category, you can see all of the categories and find your category this way. But video production is what this job is going to be about. So we can click on next. So it will show us or it will ask us to look for skills. So these skills uh, freelancers basically put on their profile and it matches you with appropriate freelancers and them with the job. So accordingly, so it goes vice versa. So video production, if we click on it, as you can see, it turns green and it adds it to our skill list. We can also do video editing video commercial, video post editing. You can also add uh, specific software requirements if you have any for this, uh, for the sake of this tutorial. I'm going to do Adobe Premiere Pro. All right, if you don't see the skill right here in the popular skills tab, you can search for it directly using the search bar. Video file format, I usually don't play with this, but you can do AVI, video genre, so you can do adventure video production deliverable. So basically all of these will be will change according to the field that you are posting a job in. But I'm just going to click on the next page. So I show you what else you can expect. So what is the task? Is it a large task? Is it a medium task or a small task? So as you can see, quick and straightforward tasks, create logo for a new product. Medium is for example, design business, rebrand package, logos, icons, and longer term works means like graphics, positioning, develop and execute a brand strategy. So depending on this, you can select which one fits your needs best. So I'm going to do small here. And how long will, will your work last? I usually do one to three months. And what is the level of expertise or experience that is needed? You can choose uh, and it will show uh, freelancers, what level of expertise you require of them. So I'm going to do intermediate. Could this become a full-time opportunity? Is it a contract to hire? No, not at this time. If it is for you, you can check the other option. Next, we set the budget. So we can either do hourly rate or we can do fixed price. So hourly rate, it can go from 15 to 40. You can adjust this depending on what your budget is. Usually for all my gigs that I've created so far, I put a fixed price. And then what is the estimate for the creator? Or what is the estimate of the project? I, uh, depending on how much I need. So for example, I'm going to do $500 as my budget for the project. And if we click on next, it will take us to uh, the description. So basically you tell people what's required of them, greetings. You can write whatever you want here if you don't already have a description ready, but I'm going to write greetings. I am searching for a talented video creator who specializes in post video editing and is loyal and willing to learn something along those lines your your description is probably going to be better but i'm just doing this for the sake of this tutorial and also if you can attach files here to your description so the next step or the second to last step is actually reviewing our uh, job post so it shows you what it's going to look like so the job post or the job or the gig <laughs> what am i saying the gig's name is video creator in this case, you can edit all of this information by clicking on the pencil icon to the side. But video creator, here's your description. Here's the category that it was put in, the skills that are required of the freelancer, the scope, so small, one to three months intermediate level, not planning to hire full time, the budget, and you can add also screen questions if you want to. 
so you can add your own questions or uh, use some of the suggested for advanced preferences you can do english level higher date number of professionals needed you can fill all of this information and also the amount earned job preferences job post preferences you can choose these as well so allow anyone including search engines only upwork users or invite only i think this is the best option so you get the best results and fastest results and you can also invite freelancers if you have somebody in mind so after you have checked all this information and make made sure that it's correct then the last step is just posting this job by clicking on this green button that says post this job and that's how we create a gig on upwork so hope this helps leave a like and sub and i'll see you next time